Hey, hey, we got some more breaking news. We got another wide receiver transferring to the sit. We got Mr. Juice Wells, receiver transferring from South Carolina. Now, come the old mess, but Juice was actually at James Madison at first and then transferred to South Carolina. And of course, now transferring to Ole Miss. But Juice has had one heck of a college career for sure, uh, no matter where he's been at. But the kid, uh, six foot one, weighs 208. I mean, you look at his stats, his whole entire college career, that dude has put up some monster numbers. Uh, several catches, several hundreds and thousands of yards in his college career, a lot of touchdowns, just overall one heck of a career for Mr. G's for sure. Now, this year, kind of a different story. Uh, for those who don't know, G's was injured early in the season, and if you look at his stats, from 2023 and you see he only had a couple catches and just you know not many yards just one touchdown that's the reason why because he got injured uh very early in the season i believe it was the third game of the year versus georgia and i believe it was the first series the injury happened so really just played two games this year um but in the past the, the kid Several catches, several touchdowns, making big plays all the time. Just a freaking beast. Uh, I love doing comparisons to kind of give other Ole Miss fans an idea of what Ole Miss is getting. And you watch the highlights, you watch the film of Mr. Juice. I don't tell you who Juice reminds me of. The first guy I thought of was Elijah Moore. You know, Elijah Moore is one of those guys, you know, former Ole Miss receiver. Now, of course, doing pretty good in the pros, but Elijah was one of those guys, you know, not the tallest, not the biggest uh, player on the field, but Elijah was one of those guys just very dangerous in open space, uh, very dangerous down the field, good making guys miss. I mean, you watch a film of Juice, that's what he kind of reminds you of. You see a bunch of similarities with him and Elijah. Yes, you know, Juice is taller. He does way more. Not quite as fast, not quite as good at making defenders miss. But you still see a bunch of similarities with him and Elijah. That's just kind of my thoughts. But also, I will say this. Now, this is kind of Juice's like biggest problem uh, thing I want to see Juice improve on. Now, Juice is one of those guys, I will say, uh, will be playing on the inside for Ole Miss. Will be one of those guys on the outside but Jesus is one of those guys very very dangerous in open space if he can you know if he can get any separation if he can get separation from a corner of a yard or two he's gonna make the catch but separation has been one of the problems for him in the past um he's juice is one of those guys has had problems winning the 50 50 balls, uh, sometimes not able to, you know, just not able to make the catch. But hey, give this guy any room, you better watch out. But anyway, another huge time picker for Ole Miss. Whew, this Ole Miss receiver room. I mean, it's going to be good. It's going to be scary next year. I mean, Ole Miss is, you know, one of the schools we have, you know, we're kind of known for, you know, we're kind of known for wide receivers. It's been for the past 10 to 15 years. We were sending wide receivers to the pros basically every year. And this Ole Miss receiver room, it's staff, it's loaded. Ole Miss, hey, we're, we got some pretty good, pretty good options for uh, receivers next year for sure. If Juice will be a starter, who knows? I will say this. Juice has a very, very good shot. Uh, he'll definitely compete. Of course, nothing's guaranteed, but I think Juice has a pretty good shot starting. If he's not starting, will definitely be in the rotation a lot for sure. But anyway, huge time pick up for the Rebels. That's all I got for the video. Whether he all starts opinions as well, too. But if you could please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, it would be appreciated. See you guys in this video. Have a good one. Howdy, tight.